Okay, here's a quick video I'm making <clears throat> that I'm, I'm just backing up here a bit. I'm using my 20 ton hydraulic press to break the beads down on four car tires. I've already successfully broken them down and what I'm using here to push it down is I'm using a block of wood to work the edge of the bead and these uh, tires are they're imported tire uh, rubber and they've gotten quite tough on 16 inch aluminum rims and as I'm walking them around so that I don't wreck them at least this is the method I've been using when I do press them down I use these um, shaves of wood to walk the rim down until I can get it far enough down to break the bead so I don't wreck the tires. So what I'm going to do is I'll lift off that and there's a can of just um, the pieces I'm using and as you can see <clears throat> by the shape of this little block of wood it's uh, just a piece of 2 by 4 it has definitely been worked pretty hard. So what I'm going to do I'm going to lift the tire down <clears throat> okay there the tire is down and all I've done is put some 2 by 6s which are just sitting off the edge of the hydraulic press and I'm just C-clamping them on and I set the height of that and that's actually been very successful now is it slow yes it is very slow and just to show you that it does work here's the other three tires the beads are all knocked down <clears throat> and they've all been done so now I'm going to roll them run them through my tire machine or my um, bead um, whatever you call it tire stand machine that I've modified now the unfortunate part on that is this fits on the big stand and works very well, but for the cobalt rims, the center spindle here is too big to go through the center of the cobalt. So I'm going to take the mini grinder and take that off, and that's in the process of being adapted. And that stand there fits on a large wooden platform, and that's where I'm going to go right after this. <clears throat> and just to show you that we do get winter here in Canada this is April the 3rd and that's my last little bit of snow before it disappears and everything else around here is now melted so here I am in Uxbridge Ontario Canada this is Craig Clayton saying yep goodbye for now <laughs>